Now this is the vet bed we're going to produce. Okay, so we're going to produce one of these. But we're going to make it to fit over a box of 100 mil high, uh, 100 mil wide, sorry, and 60 mil high. So we're going to be doing a continuation, I can't find that one either, of the bend we made in part two. Okay, but this time we're going to do it with two Passovers. Okay, now this is one I've just found out of the scrap, bag, so it's not what I've done, but there you go. Now, so I've got this box, 100 mil by 60 mil. Now I've got a piece of copper here, which is um, 600 mil long. Well, it's actually 604 mil long. <laughs> so uh, I've cut it in half. So we've now got a, a centre mark there now of uh, 300 that way and 300 that way. Now, because of the stretch of the copper, we have to do this in two ways. So we're actually going to produce like a pair of handlebars. Okay, so the first bends we're going to be doing are the two at the top. Now, the first thing I've got to do is mark where I want my first bend to go. Okay, so we want our first bend to go right on the edge of the 100 mil. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go all the way around. Now, this is important that you go all the way around. So we've got 100 mil all the way around. Now, again, I need to pull my 30 degree angle. So I'm using my piece of lead again, and I'm going to pull the 30 degree. So notice this time I didn't make a cross in the center. I actually made a mark on the actual pipe bender itself. So that is exactly where we want it. So again, stand it up. And let's bend it, because we know that's the centre point. So let's take off the pressure, make sure we've got our angle. Okay, so a little bit more, I would say, a little bit more to the centre. So that's our centre. So that is our 30 degree angle. Now I'm going to pull another angle exactly the same on the other side. So I'm just going to do a little cheat now. I'm just going to mark here on the actual guide um, on the former, sorry, on the other side, the 22 mil former. I've just made a mark where the handle goes and I'm going to pull to those two marks and it should give me exactly the same distance on the other side. So, so I should now be able to pull to that line and to this mark. So, let's have a look and see if it works out. So, we're on the two marks now. And that should give us, again, let's just check and make sure that's not moved. That should give us, again, the 30 degrees. Boom. So, it's not a million miles out. Now, That should be right on the marks where we made it and ready now for our um, bends the other way. Now, like we did before, make sure we're on top of the lines. And again, I'm going to mark, looking over the top there, and looking over the top there and then make sure I mark the centre on each side. So next thing we've got to do now is we've got to bend these two angles this way. Okay so let's get on with that. So I've put my mark back in the bender where it needs to be and this time now I'm going to pull it, but I'm not going to pull it until now I get myself a straight edge 
and I can run it through the two marks. So we've got a mark here and the centre mark there. So we know on the, on the guide it's there and we know that's going to be our centre mark there. So this now should aid me to pull the correct angle okay, for that first piece. So hopefully you can see that, that it's gone right the way through now. So I'm on that mark there, that mark there, and we're onto the, we're running parallel. We can now take this out of the bender, and we can do the other side. So, get the next pipe in the bender where it needs to be, somewhere around there, again, Stand it up and square it up, making sure it's somewhere near. And again, using our straight edge, we should be able to pull it through so it runs the same way. So centre to centre, a little bit more, and that should be somewhere close. So if we put that on the lines now. It's not a million miles out. I wouldn't say it's the most perfect bend I've ever produced in my life. So that's how we do a complete passover. Okay, so that's called a full passover. 30 degree angle with a block going over, okay, 100 mil.